Hi there. In this video, I'm going to be explaining how to use Fleming's left-hand rule. And to use Fleming's left-hand rule, there's four facts that you need to know and two important conventions within physics that you need to know. The first fact is how you hold your, uh, your fingers. So you've got to hold your fingers so they're orientated like this. So the fingers of your left hand look something like this with the thumb pointing up, first finger pointing forward, and then second finger pointing to the side. Second fact that you need to know is what the thumb represents, and that represents the direction of the motion of the current carrying conductor. Third fact that you need to know is that the first finger represents the direction of the magnetic field. And the fourth fact that you need to know is that the second finger represents the direction of the electric current. Those two conventions that I was talking about are important conventions in physics. First one, is that magnetic field lines put, always point from north to south. So with this magnet here, our south face is here, south pole is here, so it needs to point from north to south, so my field finger needs to point towards the south. If I was to flip it around like this, then my field finger now needs to point away from the north. So they go from north to south. So that's the first important convention that you need to know. The second important convention that you need to know is about the direction of the electric current. And that is that in physics, electric currents flow from positive to negative. So let's see what we mean by that. This is the conductor that I'm going to be putting a current through. And that bridges the gap between these two conductors here. Let's trace them back to uh, the battery. So we've got our battery here. We've I've just taped some uh, the wire to the end of the positive terminal there. And I said that electric currents flow from positive to negative. So they must flow from positive along this wire here. Gets to here, down this wire here. So the conductor that we're going to be putting a force onto, the current, is moving in this direction. So to summarise, our field was pointing downwards, our current was pointing this way, so our motion finger is pointing towards, towards us at the moment. So when we complete our circuit, the conductor should start moving towards you. which is exactly what it does. So let's have a quick summary. Those four facts that you need to know are, firstly, you've got to make sure you hold your fingers so they're orientated like this. Secondly, the thumb is the motion. First finger is the field. Second finger is the current. And those two conventions are, magnetic fields go from north to south, and the second convention is that electric currents flow from positive to negative. I'll leave you with a quick summary, and I hope you've enjoyed this video.